Here I am a bishop, praise God. Amen. All my churches, praise God. Preaching the gospel of Jesus Christ because I started where? In Sunday school. Amen. 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 Now, we, we let the, this truth into our minds. It's the truth that transforms us. What transforms us? Truth. What transforms us? The truth. God, we have to know the truth of God's word. Somebody say amen. amen. The more we know God's word, the more we become like Jesus. Look what John 17 and 17. Write this down. You can write this down. Amen. Sanctify them through the, the truth. Thy word is truth. Let me read it again. Sanctify them through thy truth. Thy word is truth. Come on, somebody. God's word is truth. You are sanctified and you are satisfied. Come on, somebody. And you are set aside for God's purpose through the more truth you know. Amen. The more you can love God amen. and serve him. Somebody say amen. Amen. The more le less truth you know about God's word, the less you can live for Him. Amen. Come on, say amen. amen. And that's why you are frustrated. Amen. That's why I pray God certain things are not working for you in the house of God. Amen. Come on, say amen. amen. And because, amen, praise God, we are not able, we don't know the truth of God's word. Amen. We have bits and pieces, praise God, but we don't have the whole truth. And the Holy Ghost will lead you and guide you work into all truth. And the truth will set you what? Someone say amen. amen. It will cause you, amen, to be set and made free of whatever is holding you back from serving God. Amen. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. Number three, as I move on. God used other people. What's number three? God used other people. Amen. No matter what you say, you cannot live this life and, and, and be what God wants you to be and be like Jesus Christ without other people. Amen. Now, I know some of you, praise God, feel like you are Superman, Superwoman. Somebody say amen. amen. I know some of you, praise God, I like being alone. I won't be around nobody. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. I won't be by myself. Say amen. amen. Well, that's not the will of God. You need people, amen, Pray God to make it in this journey. Amen. How did God use people? God used people to give us support. Amen. God used people to challenge us. Amen. Amen. Oh, hold on, yes, I'm happy, amen. amen. People will challenge you. Amen. Come on, somebody. Amen. If some folk, if not for the Holy Ghost, amen. they'll take you there amen. at the table singer say. Somebody say amen. amen. They'll take you there. Come on, somebody. Amen. And sometimes you need people to challenge you. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. You need people to teach you. Amen. I don't care who you are. You can learn from everybody. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. When I was in the military, praise God, I had some first sergeants who were just crazy. Amen. Crazy, prejudiced, and just, I mean, just outrageous, bad people. Somebody say amen. amen. But you know what? I learned from them. Do you know what I learned? I learned, Pastor Jones, that when I became a first sergeant, I would never act like this. Amen. When I became a first sergeant, I never treated people like they treated people. Amen. And lo and behold, by the grace of God, I became a first sergeant. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. And I learned, praise God, amen, even from bad people, you still can learn if you want to learn. Amen. Somebody say amen. I learned from the good and the bad, praise God. So when I became a first sergeant, I used all the good stuff and, and, and avoided all the bad stuff that I learned that made me a very good first sergeant. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. Everybody who came under me, they all of excelled and done great in the military. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. But you can learn from people, praise God, and you can be blessed. Somebody say amen. amen. And you need people to encourage you. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. Sometimes it's good to get a hug. Yeah. Sometimes it's good to tell you, I'm glad to see you. Somebody yeah. say amen. amen. Sometimes it's good to have somebody tell you and be encouraged. Hang on in there. It's going to be all right. It's good, amen, amen, for people to be around you that encourage you. Yeah. Somebody say amen. amen. But I'm going to tell you right now, praise God, change your circle. If everybody around you bringing you down, get rid of them. Yeah. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. Drop, kick them to the curb. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. If you don't want to do it on your own power, say, I'm excuse me, but my bishop told me today to drop you. 
So goodbye. Amen. You defeat it. So I say amen. 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 If you don't want to put it on yourself, put it on me. So I say amen. amen. Say, in, in Bishop Ruth's name, I, I got to kick you to the curb. You got to go. Somebody say amen. amen. But, 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 but why? Whatever it takes, praise God. If they're not encouraging you, they're breaking you down. Yeah. Number four, the fourth way that God make us like Jesus is this. Number one, it's through problems. Yes. Somebody say amen. amen. Number two, it's through pressure. Yes. Somebody say amen. amen. Number three, it's through pain. Number four is through suffering. Somebody say amen. amen. Praise the Lord, amen. Sometimes, praise God, through your problem, through your pressure, through your pain, and through your suffering, praise God, amen, we become like Jesus. Amen. Because he had problems. He was pressured. Amen. And through pain and through suffering, amen, he became, praise God, amen, with all power in his hands. Somebody say amen. amen. So in this life, I'm here to tell you, praise God, you're going to go through. Amen. But you can get through amen. what you're going through. Amen. If you trust them. Somebody say amen. amen. Now listen to the word of God. Listen to the word of God. What the word of God tells us to give us instructions. Remember I told you all the Pauline letters are given as instructions. Are y'all listening? Amen. Whenever you read the Pauline letters, amen, this is instruction to the church. Yeah. Listen to what, says, what Paul said to the church. Said we are pressed on every side by trouble. Yes. We are pressed on every side by what? Trouble. Troubles. But we are not crushed yes. and broken. Yes. Somebody give God a hand, pray for that. Yes. Amen. Yes. So Father, He, he gives the instructions, Mr. Elsie. Let me know, praise God. I mean, I'm pressed on every side by trouble, but I am not crushed and I'm not broken. Yes. But I'll encourage somebody in this house today. Praise God. Some of you feel pressure from every side. Amen. Oh, how many know? How many know about pressure from every side? Amen. Your children act up. Amen. Your friend, your husband, somebody, they acting a fool. Amen. Come on, say amen. amen. Talking all crazy. Your family is acting a fool. Amen. People on your job, that boss is getting on your last nerve. Amen. Make you hate to go to work in the morning time. Somebody say amen. Some of you young folks about them teachers make me sick. I can't stand there, period. Come on, somebody. Amen. You protect from every side. Amen. Amen. But the Bible tells you you're not crushed uh -huh. and you're not broken. Yeah. Yeah. So now I'll, I'll tell some of you, praise God. I'm gonna read over right. Now it's, some of you don't pray God. Just because you pressure me, you ain't gonna break me. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, say amen. amen. Oh no. no. See, some of y'all go home and just kick the door in. Boom, y'all. Amen. Break God. Oh, yeah, you've been bothering me, but you ain't gonna break me, cuz. Amen. <laughs> you, you ain't gonna break me. Come on, somebody. I got a word in me now, praise God. I'm encouraged. Can I move on to the real here? The Bible says we are perplexed. But we don't give up and we don't quit. Amen. Come on, somebody. We are perplexed. Amen. Sometimes, praise God, we are trouble from every side. We don't know why it's happened to me. How many know that? How many know? How many felt that before? Amen. You know you're a good person. Somebody say amen. amen. You know you're the hardest working on your job. Amen. You know you're always on time. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. You do your job completely. Somebody say amen. amen. You treat your children well. You give them everything they want. Amen. Somebody say amen in here. Amen. You know what? A lot of these things you can deal with, but when you give your child everything they want and they still amen act a fool on you, that, that's called perplex. Sometimes you don't know what to do. You don't know what to beat them, kick them out, what to do with them. Amen. Sometimes you look at them, you be wondering, oh, I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know. I, 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 I'm about to get a, a test here. See, you my child. <laughs> amen. Because, see, you, you give them, listen, y'all laugh, but then I'm telling the truth, you give that child everything that you can give them, and you don't know why they act the fool on you, embarrass you, and make you. Amen. Amen. The Bible says we are perplexed, but we don't give up, and we don't quit. Amen. Just because the child got you all upset, you still pray for them. Amen. Oh, come on, say amen, somebody. Amen. 
when a child acts a fool on you, you still reach around and hug them and say, but mama still love you, but you got to cut that out. You got to stop doing that. Come on, somebody. Amen. 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 We don't give up. We don't stop praying for them. God said, you're perplexed. You don't know why it happened to you, but you don't give up. You don't know why that boss acted they act, all at you. How you had a boss act that you know they at you? I had a sergeant major. Hey, I had a sergeant major. I knew she got to get me. So I say amen. Hey, because I wouldn't bow down to her and kiss up to her, amen. I knew she got to get me. So I say amen. It got to the point, amen, Papa Jones, I had to literally pray for her. So I say amen. Sometimes pray to God when your boss is really acting crazy and fuck my. Stop praying for them. Amen. Amen. So I say amen. amen. Don't give up. Amen. Let me move on here. Right. So we get knocked down, but we get up again and again and keep on going. Amen. How many of you have acted literally, literally? What? Maybe not physically, but literally been knocked off your feet yeah. by something somebody done, something somebody done said, yeah. or something. Come on, somebody. Yeah. And you have been knocked you off your feet. They are close to you. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. Some, somebody said they were close to you or betrayed you, praise God. It literally knocked you off your feet. Yes. You know what the Bible says? That's all right. We, we get up and we keep on going. Yes. Come on, somebody. That, come on, come back to the hands of God. I get up and I keep on going. Come on, say amen. Through suffering, these bodies of ours continually share the death of Jesus, so that the life of Jesus may be seen, be seen in us. This is why we never give up. Though our bodies are dying, our spirit are being renewed every day. Oh, come on, somebody give God a hair for that. Oh, how many know your body? How many of you know your body is dying? How many of you know, pray God, especially those you got older. You know, some of you up in your fifties, praise God. I mean, I don't know what happened, but when you, you turn fifty, everything seems to be. Hey. Someone say, hey, "Amen." Some of y'all ain't got there yet, but well, I'm telling you, I'm here to tell you. When you hit fifty, everything change. Somebody say, "Amen." Amen. 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 Praise God. Somebody say, "Amen." Praise God. Everything start changing. Somebody say, "Amen." amen. And if nothing else, amen, ARP start calling you, sending you all kind of stuff. Somebody say amen. It let you know you 50. Yeah, you 50. Amen. Praise the Lord. We after you. Everything new now, different. You're in a different world now. Somebody say amen. amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Our bodies, they want to get all kind of life insurance. <laughs> amen. Constantly reminding you that you're about to die. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. Y'all laughing. Some of y'all went to y'all get that ARP because some of y'all don't laugh and call it every month, every week. Somebody say amen. amen. So your body is constantly dying. <laughs> but your spirit, this is the joy. Your spirit is renewed every day. Amen. Come on, somebody. Amen. amen. Praise God. Amen. Even though I can't do something I used to do, but in my spirit, I feel like I can. Amen. Somebody say amen. Your spirit is renewed every day. Yes. Somebody say amen. amen. For our present troubles are quite small and won't last very long. Yet they produce for us immeasurable great glory that will last forever. So don't look at your troubles we can see right now. Rather, we look forward to what we have not seen. For the troubles we see will soon be over. But the joy to come will last forever. Somebody say amen. amen. But Lord, and God, praise God, the Bible says, amen, we know that these troubles produce patience, and patience produce character, Romans 5, 3, and 4. And even though you're going through trouble, it produces something. Yeah. Somebody say amen. amen. The girl night in Bible study, uh, Papa Jones, he recognizes a bishop, you have another level of patience with people. I'm not there yet. Amen. But I said, you know what? What got me there, praise God, was 36 years in ministry. Amen. Somebody say amen. 36 years of going through trouble. 36 years of people walking out. People turning their back on you. People talking about you. People scandalizing your name. Amen. 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 There's nothing worse, amen, uh, 
in Thomasville, praise God, not here, but our church is in Thomasville, the first church that we pastor, we still have that in Thomasville, amen, one of my long time members, 11 some years, amen, beginning to act up and act crazy in the church, and I warned and warned, 